Hey everybody, welcome back. Today we're going to be doing Goku Super Saiyan Blue. It could be normal Super Saiyan if you wanted. You know, it depends on how you color the hair. But the hairstyle is pretty much the same. It's Blue and Super Saiyan 1. Um, so, Super Saiyan Blue versus Frieza. Uh, Golden Frieza. So, let's get going straight away. Landscape page. Use a pencil and eraser. Don't use marker first. It's like crazy hard. And then hit pause when I move my hand or if I go too fast, right? So center point to my page is about here. So we'll start with Goku's nose and we're along this sort of center line, right? When characters are facing one another, I like to start with their nose, especially when they're in profile. So you do this like, out oh, and back in, right? So it's like this number seven sort of thing here. And then we go out for the brow on the top end. So it looks like a Z or something. And then we'll go up and around for his forehead, right? So we might just add um, like that shadow Dragon Ball characters have under their noses. Well, the Saiyans and the humans do anyway. So once we know where his brow is, so this line, we know where his eyebrow has to be. So the brow is called the brow and the eyebrow is called the eyebrow because they're connected, right? So we just take a line up this way. Down like that. And then this goes back up for the square end. And then curves back down, right to there. So then his eye. So we got like Dragon Ball square sort of eye, right? So it comes down there. And then the small line, and then bring those together about there. And then he's looking up at Freezer, right? So he's kind of, we kind of can see some of his eye just in here. Not a lot though. And then we can have tick marks underneath his eye here. And then maybe like frown lines on his nose and stuff like that. All right, so we'll finish his face. So his top lip. So it just comes down and in. And then his mouth will curve around here. So it'll go all the way down like so. So he's like gritting his teeth. So it comes across down for his bottom lip. And then you just add like a straight line sort of down here. And then add a teeth line, like so. And you can have cheek marks, you know, and like a line underneath his chin. Maybe like here, you know. And actually maybe a frown line up here too. Speaking of chin, so his lip comes in a little bit and then comes out for his chin. Back into there. Back up for his jaw, back up to here. And we can see like a little bit of his neck slash jaw underneath. So just this little triangle section just in underneath here. So your earlobe is connected to your jaw. So you just add earlobe here. So it's along this line, you know, it's like lines up with his nose. And then this comes up, around, like so. We've got a bit of a hair spike here for his fringe, and then the rest of his ear will come down into there. And then you can add bones and ligaments inside. So just like this kind of stuff inside here. Dragon Ball does it differently, kind of, to a lot of the animes and mangas and stuff. Like that. And then his sideburn just comes off his ear, goes up underneath that hair spike. And there can be some lines at the end of his sideburn and his like eyebrow here as well. Mm 
<laughs> okay, so Goku hair, right? So we did, we started one spike and there's another one for his fringe that comes along here. Right, just comes up around, down into there. And we might as well finish them. So this comes up, down, up, down, into there, and then we'll bring it around. Oops, no, I did that already. <laughs> well, it's a texture line or something. And then hairline's just under there. And then it, this spike comes out, down to there, back in. Ba, ba, ba. Okay, so then we have another layer of spikes and then a layer at the back. So you're going like candle flame, we're going back this way, back f towards the point up here, like there's a big one up here, right? So all the way, that's how big we're going. But we have one layer of spikes and then a second. So like we'll go from the back of his neck here, right? So we'll go back like so for this first one, right? And then the next one up, change direction, back in. Okay. You always want to change direction with the Dragon Ball hair. And then out like that and change direction, go down to there. And then this will go up, down, down to there. And then we got like a small one just out here. And then the next layer of hair spikes around here, right? So one here, this meets the big one. It goes up like so, this comes down. And then another one here. Another one here. Like that and another one, small one, just there. Right, so then you add um, texture lines all over. So you, like on each spike, just like this, you wanna add, just following the sort of shape for the spike, texture lines all over. You can add as many as you want. Okay, so the rest of Goku's clothing and neck and stuff like that. So his neck comes down the front here. So we got like bump out for an Adam's apple and then like neck muscle lines here. The back of his neck on this side goes underneath his clothing so we can't really see. So we go diagonal line there. This is like his shoulder, right? And then the back of his collar comes up here. And we should see maybe a little bit of neck just there. Right, so then his sleeve comes out around his shoulder here, like big curved line. And then his arm will come out here. But we'll do, we'll finish his torso before we do his arm. So 
so we get everything in the right place. So just like his back comes out here. And we got like his shoulder comes up and down. And maybe like another line out here. His back just comes down off here. And there's all like uh, full lines for clothing. Just at the top of his back here. So then this comes up to there. So, and the rest of his body and his belt. Can we see his belt? Yeah, we can. So his belt, just here. This is the blue belt and a bit of it hanging down. And let me go out like so. This comes out to here. Up and like so, and then there. Okay. Okay, now we'll deal with this arm, okay? So his shoulder, so you got like real round, right? Shoulder muscle here. And his bicep will come out here. Right, so his, his body's like turned in tilted in this way so the bicep is kind of small compared to the tricep because it's turned to, away from us so then the other side of his shoulder like the back of his tricep and shoulder here and shoulder muscle lines there like that and then where the tricep meets the bicep goes down that way and then the tricep at the back comes down towards the elbow. So the elbow sticks out here, like an L sort of shape. And then this comes up here, and lines like that. And then maybe like some extra lines on the inside here. So Frieza and Goku are sort of holding hands basically. So his hand sticks out, so his forearm comes out this way, there. He's got like a blue wristband on. It looks quite long in this picture. There. His wrist, and the starts of his hand. I won't do his hand just yet, just until I get Frieza. Or will I? <laughs> no, I don't know. I don't know what to do. <laughs> right, let me see. <clears throat> Think. <coughs> so, excuse me. No, I'll leave his hand. We'll, we'll get Freezer done and we'll bring Freezer's hand into here, maybe. Yeah, okay. So we'll just go back up and we'll do Freeze's head. We'll leave this for a second and we'll come back and try and join their sort of hands together, right? So, so Freeze's head kind of goes in behind Goku's head. We can see both Freeze's eyes. So we'll start with a tick line for his brow, right? So right here. It goes around like that. And then his eyes underneath. So his eyes are quite big now. Well, compared to Goku's eye, anyway. Then the other side. So we're in three quarter pose for Frieza. That means this side of his face is like half the size of this size. This side, right? So it's we. The this eye is smaller because it's turned away from us. Right, so we got a bit of perspective going on. So this eyebrow goes up, down, goes underneath Goku's hair there. Okay, and then this eye will come 
down here. Go across and then go like pretty straight up this way. And then his other eye here. Okay. So this eye is like skinnier than this eye. It's like half the width of it. It's much smaller. So Frieza's nose then just underneath here, right? So it's it's not like Goku's, it's not pointy, it's kind of a round nose. So curve this out like so. And then we bump it around the nostrils and the tip of the nose just there. We could have like wrinkles for skin and stuff like this. Frieza is like, you know, freaking out, you know, as usual. And then cheek marks. Like that. And then his mouth, so real close to his nose. So it like curves across here. Bring it down the back. Pretty similar to this, just a bit wider, down to there. And then we'll curve it over. And, right, Frieza's lips are usually dark, right? So we'll just color them dark. So you're just thickening them up, really. And his teeth, two bumps, around like that. And to there. And right, so then I guess his chin and stuff, right? So we can see just his chin, like here. down and up for his jaw. Like so, and then we have a line like for his bottom lip, and then the side of his face here comes up. And then we go up into here, and then up around to his brow. So it goes like underneath his brow over here. Just a little bit of his golden part, just there. And I think we can see his ear coming out from here somewhere. And yeah, so that's like his cheek. Should that go a little bit further maybe? And then the separation of colors on the other side out and into here. And then his jaw. Like so. Up to there. And we'll add some like stress lines just around his mouth. Like that. Some frowning lines maybe here. So, like Goku, ear joins the jaw, right? But he doesn't have ear lobes, so they're just these like round circular lines. With a hole sort of in here. And you can color this black. So then his head, right? So we just go around. Curve it around here. I think it goes it goes in behind Goku's hair. Just here. And then we have the purple section. Oh, 
around like so. And right, so I'm going to attempt to get the arm right to line up with Goku's right. So we'll just draw it coming out of his neck up here. So his neck comes around from his head. He's real muscly, right? So two big lines for his neck here, maybe a third front of his neck kind of comes out from his chin and his chest will be here so the neck muscles right so like that kind of thing so his shoulders here and we're going to bring the hand into there right so and he's just like a big round circle for his for his shoulder coming out from his chest here So there's no sort of shoulder muscle lines like Goku or anything. It's just like a big round circle, right? And so we want our forearm to come in here. So we gotta get his elbow. So his elbow. Right, so we want his forearm to come in like along here. So tricep. And here, bicep around the front. Like so. And then forearm will start to come across here. And he's got like this, what would you say? Um, shield or something on his arm so that so comes out around here it comes up to here somewhere and like this is where his wrist will be okay so like, like this and then the rest of his forearm comes down like so right and then bottom of his arm there roughly and there's like a jewel or something purple in here so we've got to get um, the hands to interlock right so their palms touch it's so romantic <laughs> oh. um, the relationship between Goku and Frieza is very interesting especially in Super I won't spoil it for anyone who hasn't seen Super, but um, it's pretty good. So fingers overlapping, right? So this is kind of tricky, right? Um, so how to do, right? We'll do, we'll start with freezes. Freezes might be easier. So we've got the little finger coming across Goku's hand here. Hands are very tricky, so take your time, especially when two of them are like crossing over one another like this. So you just, this is his little finger, yeah. Coming across here, and there might be like some fold lines underneath. And then his fingernail, just here. And so, then we have, so it's like Goku, Frieza finger, Goku free finger, Frieza, Goku, Frieza, Goku, right? So the next one is going to go into Goku's hand, All right? So that comes out here, goes up, knuckle, down like so, right? And you could have some like knuckle lines just here, and like maybe like a knuckle line or something there. And then we have a freezer finger, so we can see the fingernail, right? So it's going to go up, change direction, back down, around to there, and then fingernail, like that. And then Goku finger. So right, we can see like the top of a knuckle, 
and then this comes down and then the back knuckle just there then a freezer finger go up cross down round into here and then a fingernail like so knuckle lines a goku finger so it comes down you can see sort of the back of this knuckle here maybe a hand line just there and then we can see a tiny little freezer it gets kind of skinnier as we go over here because these ones are further away so there and then a goku finger like so and i think we can just see frieza's thumb or the other side of his thumb just there roughly okay right so then bicep comes down not bicep chest muscle sorry here for Frieza middle line for the chest here then it comes across and we just bring it like up into here somewhere and then you go to a chest line and then it's abs and then that purple thing in the middle of his torso there like so and there's the other shoulder on the other side so they're like grabbing hands on this side as well and then here this goes up behind maybe like a bicep line or something there and right so some of Frieza's body comes down this way leg line leg line midline there and his tail <laughs> like so and is that everything I think it is so you can add aura or stuff you know draw it around if you want it as well and um, will I yeah okay I will so just like you know just like flame you know and sometimes you can have like flame escaping or a sort of going off that way like that and we can bring and they're kind of the auras kind of meet in the middle so they're like gold on this side, blue on this side, so it's kind of up to you what way you want to do that sort of thing. Right, so I'll leave it there. Frieza, Golden Frieza versus Goku Super Saiyan or Super Saiyan Blue, whichever way you want to colour it. Hope was helpful. Thanks for watching, guys. See you in the next one. Bye.